Thanks for your patience. No problem. I'm Barbara Elman, Mama Drive. Uh, I'm here also to speak about um, removing the censure from the agenda. I don't understand why you would do that. Um, I've read the letter twice that um, Mayor Bob Co wrote. There was no apology. It was a letter of explanation. There, nowhere did he apologize to you or to the city. He, that night he was rude, he was belittling, he was unprofessional, and he represents this city. And there was no apology there. So I'm hoping that you will reconsider that so that people can come back and speak to the mayor about this issue. Uh, I believe that the letter was written because, as we most of us know, Mr. Bobco has uh, a political agenda. He has a future that he wants to run for office, and I don't believe that that censure would help him at all. So again, I'm asking you not to remove it. Secondly, I'm asking, uh, I'm confused about the monitoring, uh, the noise, and the traffic issues in the city. We've seen the, um, I don't know what to call them, the monitors out there. They've been, mon you've been monitoring over the holiday weekend, and that would be the busiest time, and it would be the loudest time, and I don't feel that that's gonna give us a fair reading, and I'm very, very concerned about the, that issue and whether or not this is being done correctly. And lastly, I understand that someone filed a, a noise complaint regarding um, Athens at the city yard, and I'd like to know, why is it that Athens is in the city yard at two o'clock in the morning? Uh, we've never had that issue with past trash company. They've always been great. And whenever we've run into a problem um, with noise in the city yard, we could call Michael Flaherty, and it was just a misunderstanding, a new employee doing something they shouldn't have been doing. But never have I had a problem, except if maybe there was a big storm in the city and you guys were there trying to get um, something out of the yard. But this, this has been going on many times between two and five o'clock in the morning and it makes no sense. And legally, I'd like to know, what is Athens doing in the city yard? They have a key to the yard? That's, that doesn't make any sense. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Mayor Perkham, I'd have to ask the of city course. Go ahead. about that if I might. Because yeah, I yeah. think that's a, I had, because I've had a number of people speak to me on this issue and I happened to be on Cyprus for a meeting uh, just the other day, and I couldn't believe the amount, of, the volume of noise that I was hearing during that whatever hour or so I was there. So I, I know you've heard on this. I'm just wondering mm -hmm. how, where are we at on that? Are we looking into this? Or? So um, I guess in the mor early morning, um, and whether it be right after midnight or um, in the 7 a.m. range or, or sometimes 6 a.m. range, um, they've been staging, they were staging, they're no longer doing this, but they were staging their street sweeping and street cleaning um, as part of the new service that they've been providing. Uh, we've talked with them, they're not um, starting that until 8 a.m., so hopefully people have noticed a uh, change in the last two days. A couple of people have remarked to me about that, that it is less noisy, so that is something that we're addressing with Athens, they were quick to respond. And so what they're doing in the yards is staging for street cleaning. And, and to the other question about the fact that we're trying to get a baseline on, on noise levels in that neighborhood correct. while there's excessive noise, I mean, so are we throw well, out that information? Well, we're gonna be addressing that and uh, that'll be addressed by our environmental impact report consultants. Uh, we also had some neighbors um, raise the issue that there was private noise, if you will, occurring also that they were concerned might be impacting the, uh, the noise study. So we'll be taking all that into account as um, our consultants prepare the environmental impact report. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you.